Assalamu alaikum everyone, my name is Shafatur Rahman. Today our presentation topic is Brief Outline, Production Process, Limitation, Advantages, Yarn Properties and Uses of Compact Yarn. So my teammates and I am going to discuss about each and every points of them. So today we are going to discuss about introduction about compact yarn that means what is compact yarn and objective of compact spinning uh, why we use compact spinning and the differences between compact and ring spinning production process of different types of compact spinning devices like quartz the machineries which used to used in compact spinning and the properties of those compact spinning process advantages and disadvantages of compact spinning and the application of compact spinning in various textile sector so let get it for re-engineering of established ring spinning process that means it, it's a, the part of spinning process that the spinning triangle is much larger than in compact spinning. Here we use three major manufacturers in the field of compact spinning that is Susan, Writer and Ginser. My next teammates will discuss about those missionaries. Now let's get into objective of compact spinning. The main objective of compact spinning is to eliminate the spinning triangle which I discussed earlier. The spinning triangle of ring spinning is much larger but in compact spinning it is much more compressed. The tension difference among fibers during twist insertion is small in ring spinning but in compact spinning it is much larger. Therefore fiber migration in compact years could be ex expected to be less than that in conventional ring spin years. Compact spinning produces a smoother yarn and less fly because of the much smaller spinning triangle and much more tension. Now, now I am going to discuss about the differences between compact spinning and ring spinning. So as I said earlier in ring spinning the spinning triangle is much larger than compact spinning and the tension differences during twist insertion is much more than in compact spinning so <clears throat> when a thin ribbon like fiber bundles is transformed into a roughly circular shape by twist insertion fibers at the edges of the bundle are faced with tension whereas fibers in the middle are subjected to compression unless there is excessive yarn tension so to release this stress, fibers subjected to tension try to shorten their path length. <clears throat> and in compact spinning, the tension differences between fibers during twist insertion is smaller than those in ring spinning. And fiber migration in compact yarns could be expected to be less than that in conventional ring spun yarns. And as I said earlier, that, that compact spinning spinning triangle is much smaller than that of conventional ring spun process. Following methods are used by machine manufacturer to condense the fiber strand that is aerodynamic condensing, mechanical condensing and magnetic condensing. So okay, now let's see a figure. Uh, <clears throat> previously I discussed about the differences between ring spinning and compact ring spinning so now we can see in the figure that the sliver weight in ring spinning is much larger but in compact spinning it is more complex and the spinning triangle as we can see is much larger in conventional ring spinning but in compact spinning it is more complex and the height of the spinning triangle is also lower than that of ring spinning so that's all of my part. Thank you, everyone. Assalamu alaikum. My name is Fuzila Tunnesa. Today our presentation topic is about the compact spinning. My previous teammate discussed about the compact spinning introduction part, its objectives, and the difference between ring spinning and the compact spinning. And he also discussed about the uh, schematic diagram 
of these two. Now I want to discuss about the production process, uh, difference compact spinning devices and the properties of compact spinning yarn. So here I go. <clears throat> At first, the production process, different types of compact spinning devices are used, but there I want to discuss about uh, uh, mainly three kinds of compact spinning device. First of all, so, Susan Elite Compact Spinning System. This system consists of an additional grafting zone which is mounted on a standard three roll ring spinning machine. An air permeable lattice apron runs over a suction tube in this grafting zone. <coughs> the, uh, and the, section, the suction tube is under negative pressure and there is a slot tiled, slot tiled in the direction of fibers movement for each spinning position. So, when the fibers leave the front roller nib line, the lattice apron guides the fibers over the openings of the suction slots. Then, the fibers move sideways and condense due to suction airflow. The openings of the suction slots get inclined to the direction of fibers flow. So, this suction slot's inclination help to condensing by generating a transverse force on the fibers band during their transport over the slot, causing the fiber band to rotate around its own axis. Then the lattice apron carries the fibers attached to it to the delivery nip line. After that, the diameter of the, the, diameter of the delivery top roller is kept slightly bigger than the diameter of the front bottom roller. The difference of diameter between delivery top roller, the delivery uh, top roller generates a tension to the longitudinal direction during the condensing process. The tension ensures the slightening of curved fibers and therefore supports the condensing effect to the negative pressure. And uh, then here we can see the lattice apron uh, Susan Elite Compact Spinning System in machine form and also its schematic diagram. So let's move to our next uh, compact spinning system. And uh, this is Writer K44 COM4 Spin. At first, the compact spinning com uh, concept illustrated in the figure is the one represented by the Writer COM4 Spin process. Actually, this figure is uh, here. Um, first of all, aerodynamic forces are used to laterally condense the drafted fibers rebound after the main drafting zone in this system. As a result of the aerodynamic forces, the spinning triangle becomes so small or it gets almost eliminated. The writer K4404 spin machine consists of a three roller double apron drafting system. So in this uh, machine, the exist zone of this system is modified to allow fiber condensation. The exist roller is replaced by a perforated drum one within which is a stationary suction unit that is connected to the machine central extraction unit two. The fibers delivered by the exist nip line of the drafting system are held on the surface of the perforated drum, moving at the drum's peripheral speed. In this way, the comfort spin technology as allows aerodynamic parallelization and condensation of the fibers after the main draft. Spinning triangle is reduced to a minimum in this compact spinning system. The compact spinning zone is the heart of the machine, which consists of the perforated drum, suction insert, and air guide element. The positively driven perforated drum gets hard wearing and resistant to fire uh, and resistant to fibers clinging. There is an exchangeable stationary suction insert with a specially shaped slot inside each drum. Then the air current, air current created by the vacuum generated in the perforated drum condenses the fibers after the main draft. So the fibers are fully controlled all the way from the nip line after the drafting zone to the spinning triangle. 
an additional nip roller prevents the twist from being propagated into the condensing zone. The compacting efficiency is the condensing zone is enhanced by a specially designed and patented air guide element. Here we can see uh, the uh, machinery's diagram of uh, writer K44 compare is a uh, comfort spin compact spinning system and the schematic diagram of writer K44 comfort spin compact spinning system. So here uh, we can see that first one is perforated drum, then suction system, then suction system, bottle roller, top roller, nip roller, air guide element, which I discussed previous slide. Next machine is Ginsar Air Complex Compact Spinning System. In this system, it also works on the basis of eliminating the spinning triangle. The conventional three cylinder drafting system is used in this technology. The fibers emerge from the drafting system and get condensed under suction onto the sub surface of a perforated build. After that, the condensed fiber strand undergoes a substantial reduction in white prior to twisting. This this uh, this reduction in this difference between the between the uh, white of the fibers emerging from the drafting system and the yarn diameter effectively eliminates the spinning triangle. Actually, the compacting zone can be adapted to the raw materials by the adjustability of the additional feed because the compacting zone between the two front cylinders can be influenced by a lower speed of the perforated apron with minimum minus 4%. For the compact uh, for the cotton compact spinning process, from 0 to 4 percent additional feed is required from a technological point of view. The machine can be optim um, the machine can can be optimally set to the most fibers with this spectrum. And the next topic is uh, yarn properties. And there are three types of spun yarn, ring spun yarn, Susan Elite Compact Spun Yarn, Comforator Compact Spun Yarn. Firstly, nominal count. Uh, which is similar in every spun yarn, then actual count, which is uh, very much similar in every spun yarn, then single yarn strength, uh, which is much more, which is much more in com comforator compact spun yarn, uh, then the CB percentage of yarn strength, which is uh, much uh, bigger in the spun yarn than any other compact spun yarn. Then the CP percentage of yarn elongation to break is uh, much more in comfort rater compact spun yarn than any other spun yarn. Elongation percentage is uh, higher in ring spun yarn. Then the coefficient of yarn friction is uh, also much more in comfort rate or compact spun yarn than in the thin places minus 50 percent is uh, higher in ring spun yarn than any other spun yarn then the thick places also higher in ring spun yarn than any other spun yarn in here then the nips uh, nips are also higher in ring spun yarn than any other spun yarn so uh, that's all of my part thank you everyone Hello everyone, I am Tasneem Jahan. Today I am going to discuss about advantage, disadvantage and advantages of compact yarn. Advantages of compact yarn. It has higher fiber utilization, higher tenacity with same twist factor. Same tenacity will reduce twist factor for higher production. It has lowest variance. It has fewer weak points. It has higher abrasion resistance. It has greater brilliance of color. It has intensive by penetration. No changing is needed before printing. Disadvantages of competition. High capital cost of the machine due additional condensing zone in the system. Increased maintenance of condensing zone which adds to cost. Execution of competition.
fewer interactions, higher machine efficiency, and fewer fabric work. In some cases, the usual waxing of the yarns in knitting might be omitted. The reduction in fees will diminish spirally and give a softer handle with needed fabric. Reading. Better packing density of compact yarn gives better abrasion resistance and heat leads to fewer end rates in weaving. Degree of sizing can be reduced, which reduces the sizing cost and the subsequent resizing cost. Reduce end rates in working, remove efficiency of working. Low end rates in weaving improves weaving with efficiency. Dying and finishing. Improve the absorption of color pigments and chemical finishing agents. As a result, dyeing cost is reduced. It is possible to produce woven or knitted fabrics with great strength, high luster, and clear structures using complete wing spun yarns. Thank you.